Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I've just come from being out with friends. I am very sweaty. It's very hot. I've just turned on the AC. I'm sorry if you can hear it uh, a bit in the background, but I cannot live without it right now. I'm very sweaty and I'm also kind of wearing some makeup. Uh, you can see the amount of oil that I get after wearing makeup or just existing for five almost six hours now and I'm very sweaty very oily and I can't wait to get this makeup off of my face so that's exactly what I'm gonna do so let's just wow so let's put this hair back and start with some skincare so this is gonna be my kind of nighttime routine now I like to put my hair back I don't have a hair clip around me, so I'm just using some section clips that I have here. Uh, this will have to do. So like you guys know, I always start with... My hands are washed by the way, I'm not doing this with dirty hands. I always start with some cleansing oil. I always do a double cleanse no matter what. But especially when I'm wearing... Uh, so much skincare and uh, sunscreen obviously sunscreen is one of those things that you have to do a double cleanse for a lot of people mention that they feel like they break out too much when they wear sunscreen which is why they kind of tend to skip it a lot and the thing is yes it can break you out if you're not taking it off properly by the end of the day uh, i have some wet cotton pads here which i'm going to use to now wipe this off and you can see all that makeup and dirt and stuff coming off. I was not wearing any eye makeup, but I was wearing mascara. So I, no matter what, take some extra time in making sure that every single bit of makeup is off. So now that I have the makeup off, I'm gonna start with my cleanser, then use a serum and then my moisturizer for the night. And today I'm gonna be using the pore minimizing range from the Dermaco. This is a range that I'm really intrigued by because all the products are pore minimizing and they contain ingredients like niacinamide, which you guys know I love. And there is a new ingredient in here, uh, which is PHA. PHAs are actually like AHAs and BHAs in the way that they work on your skin. AHAs are alpha hydroxy acids, beta hydroxy acids, BHAs and PHAs are polyhydroxy acids. The difference is that the polyhydroxy acids are like their molecules are so big compared to the other two that they don't actually sink into your skin at all. They just stay on the surface. So they're actually uh, very gentle on the skin. They're very good for sensitive skin, especially for people who cannot handle AHAs and BHAs at all. This is a good substitute because Again, it's not going to sink into your skin, it very much stays on the top, so it gives you a very superficial it's because it works on the surface and it's very good at just sloughing away all the dead skin buildup on your skin. So PHAs also can be of a lot of different kinds. The most common one is gluconolactone, which I think these products have. Yep, it's gluconolactone. So I'll get into the ingredients now, which I mentioned on the packaging, and then I'll start talking about uh, the products and I'll show you how to use them also. So niacinamide, as all you guys know, is uh, a brilliant ingredient. It works with sebum production in kind of controlling it. Uh, it helps with brightness it, and it kind of works with also making your skin better at retaining moisture. PHA is the gluconolactone that is in these products. It's a chemical exfoliant, so it's gonna, with continued use, you'll see a lot of different in texture. So how your skin feels, it will feel softer and also look kind of softer. And the third ingredient, which is in, the serum and the moisturizer it's not in the cleanser but i'm glad it's in these products because the face wash you're gonna wash away anyway these products are actually gonna stay on your skin so i'm happy that the ingredient is in these two uh, which the dermaco has called p refinal uh, which basically is an oligosaccharide oligosaccharide is basically a natural alternative to retinol it's a plant-based uh, substance you can chemically extract it from green lentils and stuff like that so let's just get into the products now i'm gonna wet my face so this is the pore minimizing clay daily face wash 
and it contains 1% niacinamide, 2% PHA and French green clay. Oh, it's actually green. This is what it looks like. And like I've mentioned a few times before, uh, all the Dermaco products now are formulated without fragrance. I'm just gonna wash it off and come back. Okay, the face wash is off and I feel very refreshed. Um, for a clay face wash, this was not drying at all. Yeah, like I expected. It doesn't have sulfates either in the last video uh, that I did. I was talking about the Sika Glow range from the Dermaco and that face wash also did not contain any sulfates. It's a plus point for me because I do not like sulfates in my face wash. I've had uh, products with sulfates before like face washes and it's not like they don't work for me. They just make my skin feel very tight after I use them. And I've noticed that when I use sulfate free face washes, I can sit like this for a while and not feel the need to put on something immediately, which tells me that the skincare I'm using definitely works. And it also tells me that the face wash I'm using is also working for me because it's taking away the dirt and the stuff that it needs to take away, but it's also not stripping my skin of its natural moisture, which is very important. So I enjoy using sulfate free cleansers a lot. Now I'm going to use the serum, which has 4% niacinamide, great, 5% PHA. So I would use this as like a 5% lactic acid serum. So this is again a chemical exfoliant based serum. So I would use it like that in my skincare routine. This is not something that I would use every single day and two times a day. I would be kind of cautious with it. I'm just going to take like half a dropper of it and put it all over my face. Yep, the thing that I like the most about the Dermaco's formulations, especially their serums, so lightweight. It just feels like any water-based serum would. I like serums that sink in and do the job that they're supposed to do, and these definitely do. I'll just follow it with the moisturizer, which contains 3% niacinamide, 3% PHA, and both of these, like I mentioned, also contain the p refinil ingredient. So when I was mentioning the whole PHA thing, I mentioned that you will see an improvement in texture. Now, because we know that there is uh, that ingredient in there as well, like a natural alternative to retinol, like I mentioned, um, that also will improve your texture. So for people who have issues with a lot of texture, lots of big pores, I get a lot of messages like that. I have really big pores, what do I do? These are ingredients for you. These are products that are made for you if you have issues like that. The moisturizer also feels very lightweight. It looked like it would be a gel, but it's not. Um, it feels more like a cream, but not a heavy cream at all. Yep, I think I'm good. So that's my skincare done. I can take these off now. That was a long day. I'm done with my skincare. I'm just gonna pop some lip balm on. If you have enlarged pores and you're bothered by them, or if you have textured skin and you're bothered by that, uh, you can try these products out. I would definitely suggest the serum. Uh, you can go to the Dermaco's website, which is thedermaco.com, and you can use my code, which is SHARMA2022. It's in all small letters, there's no capitals, and that will get you a 20% discount on your entire order. The coupon does not apply on combos and bundles because they're already at discounted prices. And if not on the website, you can check out the Dermaco on Amazon, Nykaa and Flipkart as well. Uh, you can find their products on all of those platforms. Every time you purchase from the Dermaco, your order will be linked to a child that they help educate along with Bhumi, which is an NGO. And they have pledged to help over 10,000 students this year. So your orders are also kind of creating a difference in the world. And that's always a great thing. And that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye.